Has this happened to you? Awesome, that is so good. I can't wait to make a video out of that. All right, get the card out. Let's get this. Stick it in and boom. Okay, cool. All right. Every time it crashes. Has this problem occurred for you as well? Well, I think I've got a workaround that's worked twice for me now, and I'm happy to share it with you so you don't feel like you've lost your work too. Thanks for all the fun, Insta360. Okay, so here we are at the computer. Now I've already solved my problem, so you can see the files I've got. It. I've got them there, but. What you can see in front of you is my card is plugged in there, as you can see. And there's the DCIM file with the camera one file in it. Now, if I click on the camera one file to view the files, it'll try to bring up the thumbnails and crash the, uh, and crash Windows Explorer repeatedly. This will also happen if you're trying to view the files through the app on your phone. It's, um, and I can't imagine how many other people have thought they've lost their work and uh, just didn't stumble across this uh, this workaround through trial and error. This may even work without uh, taking the files off the card. However, so what you can see I've done is I've put in the card and I have copied it across to a location on my computer that I can uh, get rid of later. Um, and you can see me doing this here. Sorry, I had to do this in post. Something went wrong with my microphone. Uh, so you're talking to future Mike now. Uh, so yes, here we are. The file is there, and you want to bring up the um, the settings, the the uh, properties of the file. And uh, it seems to be playing extraordinary slowly. Come on. You can do it from either location. So once you've got the properties of the file up, don't click on sharing, don't click on security or anything like that. It will crash Windows Explorer as well. Click on customization, and from this menu, select the documents option. This will reconfigure the folder so that it does not show thumbnails. Then click apply and access your folder. And there you go, there are your files. All right, well, I hope that helps. I hope to, gosh, that, you know, other people haven't been caught by this uh, and lost their work. That would truly suck. I, um, I'm very happy that I've managed to rescue my work and I'm amazed that Insta360 has not put out any solutions for this problem. Uh, by the way, if you are running on an older firmware, I would stay on that firmware because this only started happening along with other inconsistencies with the latest firmware. Anyway, That'll be all from me for today. I uh, hope this helps and uh, stay well, be safe, and um, thank you for watching.